and I are here to unbox the Hip Kit Club May Kit. The May Kits, that's right. We thought we'd do this together. Katie has been asking to do an unboxing with me for some time now. So here we are. Yeah, Katie? Yeah. Yeah. All right, how about you open her up and we'll see what we've got ready to create with. Mm -hmm. Okay. Do you love the pink tissue paper? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. What do you think, Katie? It looks really good. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So, this is the colour kit. So we'll put that aside for a minute. This here is the pocket life kit. This here is the embellishment kit. This here looks like a little bonus, which sounds great to me. And this here is the main kit. And this here is the card, oh, sorry, pattern paper kit. And this one here is the card stock kit. So, how about we start with the papers first? Okay. All right. So, I've got the pattern paper. Uh, these pattern papers are replica are in the main kit. They're always double-sided papers, so you can pick what you want, whatever your layout. Oh, look at that yummy one! Ooh. Yeah. So let's start with this one. Look at this stripe. What do you think about that one, Katie? It looks very pretty and colourful. Definitely catches my eye. <laughs> Definitely. <laughs> and this one here is from the Pink Paisley 5th and Monaco collection. And on the opposite side are these beautiful black and white flowers, which for me, being a big fan of fussy cutting, I think I'm going to fussy cut those out <laughs> on a layout. Uh, with you all your fussy cutting. <laughs> mm -hmm. And then we have... This one, which is another one from the 5th and Monaco collection. What do you think of this one, Katie? It looks the same as the last one, but colours. <laughs> it does. It does the same type of flower in it. And I love this, these colours. We've got the pink, the peach, the orange, and that pop of lime green. It's a nice colour combination, mm. isn't it? Yeah. All right, and on the back of that one, we have... This one, and this is really lovely. It's got a floral on the background, but it's sort of like an overlay of a black and white polka dot. If you can see that. Can you see the flowers behind there? Yeah. yeah. And what about this one, Katie? Wow. It looks like a rainbow, sort of. Like the start of a rainbow about to go over. It does. And this one is from the Vicky Booten Let's Wander collection. What do you think you'd like to scrapbook with this one? Something in a nice summer's day. Yeah, it's a nice summery photo. And on the back we have this gorgeous sort of ink droplety in a navy with sort of a off-white tone just there. And that's really lovely as well. So a beautiful Vicky Booten page. And then we've got this gorgeous butterflies. <laughs> you love fussy cutting that. I will. And Katie loves butterflies too. So this one's from the Pink Paisley with the Monaco collection and on the back is this one. That'd which, be like a birthday party. It is. It is like a birthday party. But it's a that's a really great one, especially if you're not wanting really bold background. You want a pattern colour paper background, but you don't want it to really be bold. So this one's sort of a good one that you could, you know, work a photo on and it wouldn't you wouldn't lose your photo in the background. Yeah. So that's that one. Then we have this one. What's this one? Describe it. It's like a polka dot one mm -hmm. with orange polka dots and like a pinkish background. With Pinky peach. Mm. Yeah. And on this side is a gorgeous orange flower. Whose favourite colour is orange? Dad's. <laughs> Dad's favourite colour. Oh, this one is absolutely gorgeous. I actually don't want a scrapbook on that one. How great's that one? A beautiful alphabet and it's got ultimate, ultimate stencil guide up the top there and it's got the alphabet in a smaller font down the bottom and that's really just a great statement piece. You could put that into your album just as a feature page I would think but um, yeah that'll be hard to scrapbook on because it's so yummy. And on the back of that one 
it's like a deep navy with a white floral but it also sort of has this shading going through it if you can kind of see that it's like it's a little bit blurry or is that just my eyes Katie? No, it's no? not just you. Okay. Oh, this one looks gorgeous. It's got uh, that beautiful citrusy colour Eliza on there. Eliza would like that. Eliza, Katie's cousin would love that. And a classic black and white stripe which is perfect. Yes, just like the shirt I'm wearing now. Another absolutely stunning piece of cardstock. Another feature page that I will really struggle to scrapbook on because it's gorgeous. I love like that a grid... pink in the corner. Oh, like you like this pink? Yeah. Yeah? That's a gorgeous. So out of all those colours, this one's your favourite, is it? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and on the back of that one, another gorgeous piece which has the numbers down the side there with the line. So a really classic statement piece. Absolutely gorgeous. There. Grammy would like that one. Grammy loves big florals. Yes, mm. this is absolutely a gorgeous piece. These papers are absolutely stunning. And I can see Fussy cutting this one out as a real statement piece on a layout. will look beautiful. Here we go. We've got a cut apart sheet. This is a fab. These are so great for layering up behind your photos and just adding those extra little bits for journaling. This one says all in the details. Oh. Kiss cuddles. The God still good still. The good stuff. <laughs> Currently, today is good, lovely, gorgeous vintage camera there in black and white right now and these fabulous tags along the bottom and I can't get enough of these especially in my project life album and on the back of that what? that's my favorite color Katie's favorite color a classic stripe so can't go wrong with that one so whose favorite color is this mommy yes this is my favorite color a beautiful pink diagonal stripe and on the back of that is that gorgeous black and white scripty font. You could fussy cut that out. Just given that size, it would make a really easy thing to fussy cut out you for your could, custom titles. You could put a picture of you on there because I know that would match your photos. <laughs> yes, yes, I'd like that. Beautiful. So there's all the pattern papers. And to coordinate with all the pattern papers in our cardstock kit, we have got the following colours. That's right, Dad's favourite colour, <laughs> orange. Mum's favourite colour, pink. <laughs> Your favourite colour again. Mm -hmm. A peachy. And again. This one here. That's more you. Yeah, the yeah. soft pinks. The gorgeous soft pink. The nice yellow. Eliza would like that one. Mm -hmm. And then we have a nice white. And. Is that navy blue? Yeah, navy. Yeah, navy. And my favourite colour. What's that? Aqua. Beautiful. Yes, that one is called Aurora. <laughs> so there's a beautiful coordinating cardstock that match perfectly all these beautiful papers here. So really great. These cardstock uh, kits are really great if you love a plain background and also love layering up behind your photos with multiple layers just to really bring your photo off the page. So I recommend if you are thinking of becoming a subscriber to check out the cardstock kit and of course if you're wanting two of each of the papers grab yourself an additional pattern paper um, pattern paper kit. So there's all the beautiful papers this month and as I said in the main kit you will get all the pattern papers so that's those which I've already been through those so I'll get you to hold those Katie Yeah. and we've got all these wonderful embellishments Ooh, if, you become, if you become a monthly subscriber um, you get the main kit and then each month you get to decide whether you want to add on the extra add-on kits um, so the main kit is what you're subscribed to and then the add-on kits will be available for you to add on um, each month at your discretion. So some months you might want to add on all the extra kits, other months you might want to add on just one or one or two things. So what do you think of these Katie? 
I think that pink would go very well if you were doing like a nice bright um, layout. Mm -hmm. A bright layout. Mm -hmm. And what this gorgeous citrus green here. And these are Pink Paisley Fifth and Monaco gems. So they are perfect for those little accent pieces. I'll put that there. We've also got some thickers and this is the Sunshine Thicker Set and they are a puffy kind of sticker. Oh no, sorry. They're like, um, they're not puffy, they're like, um, hmm, what are these like, Katie? Squishy. Squishy. Yeah, they're, yeah, they are squishy, they're puffy, but they're squishy. not the usual, they're really thin and shiny. So, um, yeah, but lots of fabulous fabulous sayings and like Katie said before this the paper is a real summery and this one here is a perfect theme for summer, summer. splish splash sunshine Sh oh sunshiny days fun hello summer fun in the sun pool party hello hello oh happy day so and a really great color pink being my favorite color so that's really wonderful <laughs> We also have Ooh. these. These are the coastline thickers, and these really are those spongy. It is two tones, so you've got the pink foam on the bottom with the silver sort of um, holographic on the top. And I think I've had these, I've, I've used a set of these before, and they are fabulous. A good size, a classic font. You've got lots of A's, lots of E's, lots of N's, O's and really great some numbers so I always love having the numbers so you can put a date on there they you... look like a really nice color that's one of my favorite colors now the holographic yeah you can see a bit of all of them in there there's more than one color mm -hmm. <laughs> that's a good thing about them the cardstock stickers that we've got in the main kit are the pink paisley fifth and monaco I really love that block um, pop of black in this collection um, it's when you're dealing with bright colors just to add that little bit of black really just sort of brings it all all in together so you've got loving this life forever always happiness shine let the fun begin beautiful lots of other little random words yeah smile me me and you yeah, lots of things there. Mm -hmm. Lovely. Hello. Look at the birdies, the butterflies, and these are really great for project life and pocket style scrapbooking um, as well. There we go. Our ephemera that we got this um, month is the Vicky Booten. Um, I think this is the Let's Wander collection. Yeah, it's travel themed. Um, yeah, so we'll just hold that up. That's got lots and lots of gorgeous travel themed and really goes perfectly with the Fifth and Monaco collection with those pops of black, the pinks, the oranges, the bit of citrus. Um, yeah, that's Mom. great. How cute's that? Really cute. Yeah. Mummy, why do you like black so much? Well, when I'm scrapbooking, sometimes I, black can be scary when scrapbooking. But sometimes, if you just add that little bit of black, it brings your layout together and everything sort of comes together. And that's why sometimes I like to use black and white photos instead of coloured photos. Because it oh. helps everything come together. I never knew that. <laughs> You'll have to try it on one of your next layouts. Yeah. So that's the main kit there. And now... We've also got these. Now I'm not sure if these are part of the main kit or whether they just um, were a bonus or I'm not too sure where they're meant to sit in which kit. But they're absolutely gorgeous stamp market um, enamel dots and you've got them in the clear. So it's like a water droplet and the white which is really perfect and often when we get these enamel dots we don't get clear and white. They, they're usually colour themed so it's lovely to have this neutral um, neutral colour and I particularly love to splatter on my layouts, my mixed media layouts with white watered down acrylic paint so this might do the job sometimes when I'm not wanting to use a mixed media product mm. on there so that's those uh, now we'll move on to the embellishment kit mm. the embellishment kit's always full of fun fun right. things <laughs> yeah. put that over there so first up we've got these gorgeous little, oh you sneaky, um, 
first up we've got these gorgeous little crepe paper Willow Lane dimensional flowers. These are really sweet and will make a really intricate detail on your layout there. Which flower do you like the best, Katie? Um, I think I like either the white or the pink. Yeah. I the, think the pink looks How gorgeous good. are these? Look at the detail in those. I like the pink how it's like shiny around there. It is. It's almost like holographic, a little bit like yeah. your your new favourite colour. Yeah, so yeah. they are really cute and will make a lovely feature on a, on a layout. Next up we have some puffy stickers. These are embossed puffy stickers. So they're just that little bit extra yummy and they are from the Amy Tan new Amy Tangerine collection. Um, the ice cream makes me feel hungry. <laughs> does it? <laughs> so they're lovely. Another little element from the Amy Tangerine collection are these gorgeous little paper bows. They're lovely because they're dimensional, but they're really quite flat, so they're not going to bulk out your layout too much. I like the green with the flowers down there. Definitely. They look really pretty. Yes. <laughs> that's kind of like my school uniform. Though. It is. looks a little bit like your school uniform. So that's those. We also got a Stamp Market washi tape, the, rain the rainbow one and that looks really cute there if you can see that all the colors of the rainbow Katie's favorite color my favorite color dad's favorite color dad's favorite color so that's that I that. would use that every day <laughs> we also have the stamp market detail and phrase stickers there's 62 pieces in here um, absolutely gorgeous they have a gold they sort of got a gold foiling over the top of many of them and in those lovely colours that we're seeing in the kits. That um, strip down there kind of looks like the tape here. It is. That tape there. Yeah. So we'll definitely be able to use that strip as well as some washi tape on mm -hmm. there. So the last thing in our uh, embellishment kit is this gorgeous Dear Lizzie stickers. These cardstock stickers and they are just once again bright and happy, perfect for this collection and the pattern papers that we have and it is full of summer fun. Look, there's even a little one doing a cartwheel. That reminds me of you, Katie. She's even got your blonde hair. <laughs> the gymnastics. Yeah. What else do you like on this one? Um, that the car will kind of reminds me of when I did one in the basketball court. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Girls just want to have sun. <laughs> Definitely. So here and now, stay cool, delightful, a bit of gold foiling on some, some of the features. Some birds, which look really pretty. I like that bird there. It yeah. looks really pretty. Yeah, you like those colours? Yeah. Yeah, we need to get a caravan, that one. Uh -huh. <laughs> we need to get that one. We do. So that is our embellishment kit. So they look like they are really fun to play with. So I'll pop them over there, Miss Katie. Yep. Um, we might go now on to the colour kit. Ooh, I love colours. You do love colours. Do you know what these are? Um, no. No? These are ink pads for stamping. Ooh. Never seen coloured ones before. I've only seen black ones. Mm -hmm. So we've got three colours in the colour kit. These are colour box, they're dye ink, so they give that really sharp, clear impression when, when you're using your stamps. I always, when I want that, when I'm using words um, on my, in my Project Life albums and in my traveller's notebooks and things, and I want that really sharp impression, I always try and find a dye ink to get that. <laughs> colour box um, is a premium stamping company. Um, they've produced um, beautiful inks for many years. And how cute are the titles? Mm. Cherry Kisses. Citrine, which is that gorgeous citrus colour that I've been goo and garring over. <laughs> and and melon, melon Orange. Melon Orange. So we've got those three stamp pads there. My favourite's the Cherry Kisses. That the one looks cherry my favourite. <laughs> Definitely. You'll have to have a turn of that. Yep. <laughs> and the other thing that we got in this month's colour kit are the some Vicky Booten stencils. And you get a three pack here. So we've got 
in here we've got these gorgeous sort of pinwheels, this um, f like vines here, and this absolutely gorgeous floral. Um, yeah, which one's your favourite, Katie? Mm, I think it's this one or this one. Yeah, mostly like, that one. Yeah, you like yeah. that one. All right. Well, we'll have to do some um, mixed media stuff with those, yes, won't we? So that's the colour kit. And last but not least, I have to say because I'm doing Project Life in 2020, and I'm doing some incorporating um, layouts and pocket style pages. Um, the pocket style kit, uh, the sorry, yeah, the pocket pocket kit is my favourite at the moment. You get custom cards designed by Kim Watson um, and in multiple sizes, so perfect for Project Life. I love that um, pink. And lots of embellishments, usually smaller ones because we know that we're working in that smaller format. Can you pass me those scissors there, Katie? Yeah, your fussy kind of scissors. <laughs> My fussy cut, that's true. They, these scissors, I've had them for years, but they are the best for fussy cutting. That's probably why you like it so much. Mm -hmm. I hope they never die. <laughs> they probably will, Mum. You better realise that. <laughs> Everything dies, you know. Okay. Can we see some colours that you like there, Katie? I like that pink mm -hmm. there. Definitely. Alright, let's have a little look up here. So these are the th three by four inch pocket cards. That's so. one of my favourites. <laughs> And it's good because you can add some journaling here. Yeah. The simple things. Ooh, one okay. of my favourite colours. Definitely. <laughs> a navy little, um, it looks like it's been stitched with the sewing machine there. So navy and white. You could put that with like a, a picture of my Jackson there. Mm-hmm. It is. Navy is a nice strong, strong colour, isn't it? Mm-hmm. Got this gorgeous pink and white. You would like that one. <laughs> Definitely. Dad would like that. <laughs> Definitely. And I love this idea because you can put some stickers down here or put some numbers or some words down there and then you can journal on each of those things. Mm. Sort of like a point card. A lovely little black and white floral. A little photo could go into there. Yeah, definitely. A little journaling. A bit of journaling for that one. You could do some journaling with Grammy then. Definitely, those big florals. May. And this is our May title card. 2020. Definitely. Some nice bright colours. Definitely. <laughs> there. Live in the moment. Nice naturey. Yes, it That's is. That's a nice picnic blanket. It does look like a picnic blanket. <laughs> a nice gingham. Take it easy. Take it easy. Pink and white. Can't it's go nice wrong. Nice flowers. You like that one? Yeah. Beautiful. So they're our three by four pocket cards. And these ones here are three by eight. So we've got this one here, which has a title, good story, and you could add some photos here or a photo and some journaling. Well, we could draw a picture there of what the story looks like. Yes. Yeah. And this one here is lovely, that rainbow again, a bit mm. similar to that washi tape, and it has some memories on there. That's kind of like one of the bows. That's right, one of the Amy <laughs> Tangerine bows. So, as you can see, these Pocket Life cards are coordinating really well with our embellishments and our paper ranges that, that we've got this like month. That's one of the big sheets that we saw. That's right. Yeah. These are our 4 by 6 inch cards and that's that beautiful colour palette with Katie's favourite one on there. My favourite pink. <laughs> Your favourite pink. This week documented. A gorgeous citrus and ooh, that's a good combo. Yeah, that, that's kind of like that dot is kind of like my dress. Yes, you do have a dress in a black and white dot. And these ones here are... Ooh, my favourite colour. You're more of your favourite colour in that mm. larger format there. So that navy and white polka dot. That looks pretty. This one here, Katie's favourite colour. And a large section for large journaling. And how cute is this one? The good vibes. The good vibes. So they're our exclusive Hip Kit Club Pocket Life cards. And to complement them, we have got the Amy Tangerine die cut shapes from her new collection. 
and that has some glitter elements in there if you can see those glittery ones there and look all these beautiful things here we can got some frames some more ice creams some great little journaling prompts these flower clusters that are really bright and happy perfect for layering and what making I, those features ele featured elements what i do is once i've used them i cross them out so i know which ones i've got left that is you have shared that tip before haven't you katie so yeah. what katie was just saying then is when she pulls a piece of ephemera out of her, one of her kits she crosses it off on the back so she knows that when she's looking through her things she can just reference the back and she'll know what's left in her ephemera pack so that's those we've also got these fifth and monaco puffy little stickers these are really wonderful for project life wow. as you can see they've got they're just a great size to be able to add a little feature title on one of your cards. When you said wonderful, wonderful. Yes, that could be a title, <laughs> could it? Here we go. We have some Happy Hooray Puffy cardstock stickers. Once again, these are really cute and really small, so you can incorporate these into your Project Life album. And that was kind of like the bow as well. That's right. It all sticks together. It all sticks together. So we've got some really cute, sweet things. These are obviously designed to um, coordinate really well with that new Amy Tangerine collection. And I have to say, those two little birdies are just delightful. Little bright, glittery bunting there. Cute little rainbows. Woohoo, thanks, family. Love you, speech bubble. Lots of little bits and pieces just to add that something a little bit special onto your layout or into your pocket life album. When, and lastly we have the Stamp Market Ephemera Pack and it's obviously from the collection called Miss Modern and it hasn't got a picture on the back so we can't cross those ones off but maybe we could just have a quick little look in here and see what's going on. You got it? <laughs> I think we have. Slide those out. We might move that across there. And then we can... I'll take these down. Oh, these look absolutely beautiful. I've just pulled out this light pink one. Look at that. That's absolutely That's gorgeous. That's your one. <laughs> Life. Great scripty font there. Oh my goodness. These are cute. Look at these little, little can I have them? <laughs> label cards. These are perfect for project life, aren't they? Look, yeah. there's lots and lots of them. I like that one! All different colours there, so they're really cute. Oh, there's still more. Heaps of them. Heaps, heaps of those. They are just delightful. you got a lot of stuff here, Mum. Mm -hmm. Oh, it looks like we've got a whole lot of tags. All different colours that you're able to really custom. If you needed a tag, you've clearly got the tag colour com <laughs> spectrum there to match so if we need a tag I think we've got what have we got seven oh no here's another one eight gorgeous tags and <laughs> some of them have I'm this stamped. die cut out of them they look absolutely gorgeous <laughs> there we go so we've got those and then just other little bits and bobs here love this right now favourite this day Kiss cuddles recorded on today, captured another little one of those. <laughs> Note oh, look at these best day ever! And one. Hello, so that is a super cute little set. I can't wait to use those. So, as you can see, May is going, it looks like it's going to be fun documenting all documenting life and welcoming in the summer months for a lot of you over in america the walking the warmer months are now coming we're heading into our cooler months here in australia but i have plenty of photos of summer, summer. shenanigans <laughs> so katie what do you think is your favorite thing out of all the kits mm, i think it was the words that had the um what's it called again the Oh, the holographic yeah, alphabet. The holographic. Yeah, okay. I think they were my favourite. I think so. And I have to say, the Miss Modern Ephemera may have stolen my heart. So thank you so much, guys, for checking out our unboxing. 
Yes, there they are. And, <laughs> and um, thank you. And Kate, did you have fun unboxing? Yeah. <laughs> sure did. All right, guys. Take care. Bye. Happy scrapping. Bye.